Friedrich Schmeling was just a teenager in 1957 when he was sentenced for sexual acts contrary to nature. Some 50,000 German men were convicted of homosexuality under a Nazi-era law which remained in force for decades after the war. Now, after a long struggle, the German government is set to clear their names. I've had cancer twice and was operated on but maybe I'll still get to enjoy the moment my name is cleared. When the legislation passes, Friedrich will receive compensation for his conviction and the four weekends he spent in juvenile detention. Others won't be so lucky. Gottfried Lorenz was the target of a two-month probe in the 1960s, but was never convicted. He has spent his life fighting for gay rights, but has also lived his life in fear. For me, it meant always being scared that something was going to happen to me. That's very powerful, that something could come crashing down on me at any point. It weighed on me. Only 5,000 of those convicted are still alive. Friedrich's partner of 28 years, Bernd, died without seeing justice. He regrets not being able to share this milestone with the man he shared his life with.